Da -dun 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 -dun. Show World. Welcome to Show World, gamers. Josh here, and we got some exciting new developments taking place at Universal Studios, Hollywood's version of Super Nintendo World. But before we get to that, let's take a quick look at the construction taking place at the Florida version of Super Nintendo World coming to the new Epic Universe theme park at the Universal Orlando Resort. Now, while the Mario Kart ride, as well as the Donkey Kong Minecart Coaster, have continued to gain ground, construction is going to have to be paused for some cleanup after the devastating Hurricane Ian battered much of Central Florida. As you can see here, Epic Universe construction will have to pause while they deal with flooding in a lot of the construction areas. The Super Nintendo World area here appears to have been spared from some of the worst flooding, but there have been some talks that this is going to set back some of the new theme park construction enough that it could affect the opening date. We have not actually heard a concrete date yet, but we will definitely keep you guys updated when we get that info. Now moving across country to the West Coast version of Super Nintendo World coming to the Universal Studios Hollywood Resort in Southern California, there are a few new pieces of merchandise starting with these beach towels which look really cool as well as some hand puppets. So far we've seen Mario, Yoshi, and Toad. I expect there to be more characters showing up soon. Also that City Walk store we've been keeping an eye on still hasn't opened its doors yet. Still haven't heard a date or anything but we're going to keep our eye on that. All right, now moving on to the actual theme park construction, we have hit some big milestones. As you can see here, the sign at the entrance of the park next to the warp pipe has been installed and it looks really good. Also, we have some new drone footage thanks to City Cruising in 4K. Check out their channel for some awesome drone footage. As you can see here, they have completed paving most all of the walkways. Also, word has been stated by a Universal team member that the Mario Kart Bowser's Challenge attraction is not only complete, but it has been for some time. This does give more validation to the rumors of an earlier than expected opening date. We will let you know as soon as we hear any info, so make sure you hit that subscribe button and let me know any thoughts or questions about Super Nintendo World in the comments. Thanks for joining us today, gamers. Shoch World, out.